Now I'm getting started on the second thought form that's in the grammar of issue two. So we've already, or I've already done the first one, which is called imagination. And now I'm gonna to move to the electric node. There's videos if you wanna see my thoughts and experience when I did this one. But now I'm gonna start with this electric node. with here I've actually already started to collect some thoughts for myself for my personal experience and I'm realizing that it's really about being tangible having tangible things both in my service that I offer but then also something that people can have as a foundation to fill in so I'm exploring this idea and what I did on my website today is I did some updates let me show you isn't that fun there's a caterpillar climbing up the screen making his way to some transformation, just like my website. So for the website, what I did is I went ahead and I added tutoring. So this was something that I was hoping to do one-on-one, -on -one, either in person with somebody or through Zoom. I'm just not able to do it in that capacity right now, but I can do online communications. So then you come to the tutoring page. I've just kind of laid out a little bit about my thoughts about what the tutoring could be and the ways that we might go about it. What I'm looking for is if anybody has a testimonial of the work that we've already done together, I would love to add that to this page. So if you have something that you'd like to share with me to put on here, I would greatly appreciate it. The other thing that I've done is I've added a form that you could fill out that how could I help you? What is our best form of communication? And then this is what I wanna point out, the energetic exchange, how we might be able to work together as co-creators or collaborators of change. So what my thoughts are is that if you have the money and the resources and you'd like to make a donation, then that's an option. Another option is that I could really use help sharing this message and getting the quantum memoir out there and having more people you know, be able to sit down with their thoughts and write them down and see a larger picture. So if you also want to just share the work, the quantum memoir work that you do online, then to me, that's a form of exchange that we're um, having together. So if you'd like me to help you one-on-one -on -one with tutoring, then one way that you can pay for that would be just to share the work that you do with other people so that you could help spread the message. Another option would be if you posted about the grammoire, which is the book I'm going to show you right now. If you make any kind of posts or spread that to your audience, then that would be another form of exchange for me helping you with tutoring and customizing your own thought form practice. So this is what I have done recently. So the reason I'm making these changes is because I'm inspired by the people that I've been working with. For the last few years, I've been kind of experimenting with reciprocity and I've really tried to offer everything that I do for free and it's gotten me to a certain degree it's a certain degree of success a certain degree of understanding and relationships but as I've been offering things that are more tangible like these books or my time I've noticed that there's an increase in the energy that I'm receiving and that's being put out through the quantum memoir through this fruit of life cycle this form so what I would like to do is you know take what I've learned from the people that I've worked with and keep like beta testing keep tweaking and changing and so that I find the right combination that is useful for me and useful for you so what I'm gonna put in my connect sphere are testimonials like I've been tested <laughs> so much so if you have a testimonial that I can put on the website if I've helped you or inspired you in any way I would greatly appreciate those words and that time and energy that you could provide so that I can share with others what they might gain from this quantum memoir practice the other thing that I'm looking to do is I realize I need help I need help sharing this message. So if, you know, we have an exchange, like say I give you tutoring. So let, let's do that. Um, express, uh, let's see. I like this up here. Tutoring. I actually see this as something that's tangible. Well, 
you know, a, a service between two people's imagination and minds and thoughts and words doesn't necessarily give you like a tangible thing like, you know, here's a product, it's tangible. But it does make a tangible change in your life, you know, through your physical body, you might become healthier in some way, you might become prosperous in some way. So if I'm able to offer a tangible thing to you through tutoring, then I'm doing my job. I'm doing the great work that I've set out to do. So if you have a testimony that relates to that, I would love to hear about it and share it on the website so that I can share that with other people, kind of, you know, inspiration of what they might gain from working with me. So really what I've been learning through this um, experience of really putting myself out there in a way that I have a vessel for people to fill up, either through buying one of my products or making a donation through the different um, options that I have, I've come to a new understanding and a new relationship with the work that I'm doing. So I think that this page is, you know, it's tangible. <laughs> it's, it's going to be this pot of gold that I see here on the second thought form called the electric node. So I haven't really gone through these notes yet, but this is the experience that was coming up for me is to really make things tangible in my life and to work with that. So I'm gonna go ahead and go through these notes and then as these thoughts start coming up, I'm gonna filter them into this thought form and hopefully I'll be sharing those with you. And again, if you wanna get a copy of the grammoire, this is another way you could support the work that I do is purchase this art publication. It's called The Grammoire and the whole idea is that these little, you know, um, doodles, these symbols, these expressions are to seed some thought within yourself and then you take your own personal self-reflection, your opinion about them, your perception of them, and then you create your own thought form and alchemize the experience that you're having through these prompts. And what they do is they sort of start to create synchronicities between us and then perhaps you and your environment. And so the whole idea is that we can kind of evolve our human consciousness and go beyond these shadows that we've been experiencing.